Welcome to Poets from the Neighborhood. My name is David M. Harris. And I'm Kristen Kendall. We hope you'll enjoy the poems we'll be reading today. Poems written by your friends and neighbors. Witch Lady by Louise Collin. The villagers say, don't go out to the mountain where the leaves are wet. At a moment when the air holds the color of violets, the scent of marigolds, and the sound of tiny voices speaking unknown words, calling her to the roots and the leaves, the witch lady opens the pointed door of her cottage in the woods. The witch lady loves the darkness, is friends with the snakes and the foxes, touches the hidden babies of the field mouse, thanks the roots and leaves for coming to her hand. She walks the village, drops a cure for a crying baby on its mother's doorstep, creates a tea to console the woman who grieves through the night. The sun rises, drying the leaves on the mountain. At a moment when the air holds the color of violets, the scent of marigolds, and the sound of tiny voices speaking unknown words, calling her from the roots and the leaves. The witch lady closes the pointed door. Embers of Havana, David B. Stewart. Smoke hangs loose and hovers near. Silence twists forgotten names. Bitter lips that blew them here kiss and feed Havana flames. Lips pull tight, the firebrand glows. Lightless walls forget the day. Smoke-ringed thoughts, the breezes blow. Cuban brown to ashen gray. Zephyrs roll the smoke along. Soft, each move bolero slow. Water ripples quiet song. Slowly drawn, Havana glows. Whispered waves are highway sighs. Leaves deny the traffic's light. Orange-embered dancers fly. Tap Havana, fill the night. Life flows in the dwindling burn, cooled without its inner spark. Silent, still the highway churns. Shuttered up, Havana's dark. A place by Louise Collin. An old apple tree grows there, hunched over a tiny river. It shades the baby fishes, frantically swimming to somewhere. Sometimes the Lord rides by on a humble donkey. There is a love that will burn you to ashes. A wild wind love that scatter your fences and a tornado of sand. Tear your heart from its home. Tear your atoms apart. Own your body forever. Leave you naked in the world. Vanishing Act by David M. Harris which is me. Lightning on distant blue mountains. Night falls, dimming the cascade. Soon it will be dark. I see and pass on. A Speck by Vera Jahar. A speck in the circle of life. We in the ever expanding universe, seek the beginning, 
or chase the end? Another of my own poems, Transitions. The house we rented wasn't on the old maps, but the cemetery was. Beyond our fence, graves ran up the hill. A boy who died at Bull Run. We cleared his forgotten plot and tended it. We protested our own war. Candles on his stone. We retreated to the wide, flat, colonial slabs. There we ate a midnight meal of squabs and strawberries. We sat on tombs and tried to cook up the future. Thank you for watching Poets from the Neighborhood. We hope you'll join us again soon.